Previously on Fire Emblem 6. Oh, oh. yeah. Well, fuck. Oh, uh, well. And now, let's get on with the episode. Hello everybody, welcome back to Project Ember. Previously we did begin chapter uh, 15, I need to say 25 then, no, it's chapter 15 of um, the Etruria arc, I guess it is. I think this is the part we're at. But yeah, I played roughly back to where we were before, as I did get someone killed, so if you want to see that, go check out the previous video. And yeah, let's just go figure out what the hell we're gonna do now? If so I manage to beat uh, the boss down without getting anyone killed <laughs> this time. So now we have this to deal with and we have Garrett who's here, who's coming our way. So this is a pretty important turn ahead of us. So Wraith is here, he's got his spear equipped, which is actually good. This means that someone like Gonzalez, and yes, I haven't promoted Gonzalez yet, but this means Gonzalez or someone like that will have an actually Possibly an easy time uh, taking care of the boss. Although I could walk crit, which would be kind of funny. Or I could Sophia the boss. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> still a spear wielding uh, boss enemy, so I still have to be a little careful, right? I just wanna, I wanna, see, I wanna set this kill up for Gonzalez. Uh, although I doesn't really need it, to be honest. You could just get away with, like, attacking a Great Knight or something. Or maybe even the chip from just doing this would be enough to get him his level. Let's see. Because I could have also given him the Killer Axe so we'd have a crit chance. But hey. <clears throat> One experience off. Go figure. Okay, who do I want to get this kill on then? I mean, it, ideally, like, Thea, but she's a little preoccupied. She's holding onto Shanna, if I'm not mistaken. Let's just use Percival, let's just... oh my god. This guy does have a Brave Lance. Uh, I've got to be a little careful as well. Let's see, okay. Garrett's not in range. And I need to turn on Percival's animations, but yeah, as you can see... Percival's just eating up these brave weapons. He just, just doesn't give a shit. <laughs> he does not care. Anyway, Sophia, can you kill a... You can. You can kill a Myrmidon. Well... Very nice. Man, it would be so lovely to get a guiding ring from this village that's coming up, huh? <laughs> That'd just be fantastic. But, yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen. Okay, nice, and Sword Reaver. Give me that crit, yeah! God, I love Berserkers. That's why I'm using two of them. HP, Strength, Look, Defense, very good. That is a very good level up for Geese. He does need all the bulk he can get. And I'm definitely gonna heal Echidna here. Oh, I do I not have you with a regular heal staff. Oh yeah, I accidentally send the Divine. So I think that's where his heal staff went. Uh, which is a little, a little awkward, because I kind of want Lina to attack. Because I mean, as you can see, she's freaking nuke. I mean, she's just ridiculous. It's a little insane how ridiculous Lina is. Um, I guess what I can do is dance for Thea. Why I didn't think of doing that. With a wing spear, she might be able to kill the boss. Look at that. That's great. <laughs> Beautiful. It's that girl, isn't it? She isn't human. Why do you seek her? To use her power? Ugh. See you later, nerd. Look at that experience. So yeah, after this next level, I'm pretty sure... Nice. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna promote Thea. Because... The longer I wait to do it, the... Probably harder it's gonna be... To actually get her kills and her, her, for her to remain... Useful, per se. 
And nice and walt crit. Because why would he not crit, right? He's the crit machine. Even with an iron bow. They give... I know, I guess he's just got a lot of skill. Yeah, I mean, he has 26 skill. But skill doesn't... Skill effect crit? I'm pretty sure it does, right? Like... I don't know. I don't know what I was gonna say is that I don't... Did they give snipers a crit bonus? I never use snipers in FE6 normally, so I don't know what they are usually like. If they did actually have some kind of... Um... Like, unique bonus, which... I haven't heard of them having before. Lena, level two, magic skill resistance. Okay, <laughs> you do your thing, Lena. You do your thing. Yeah, I do need Lena to actually get a little bit of a move on. Um, just for the fact of recruiting Garrett. Man, I don't want to use the Cortain. Why? I guess I can just kill a bow. Wow, Light Blade does a lot of damage, but oh my god. Look at that crit animation for the female snipers. That was crazy. I'm a fan. I'm a big fan of that. Okay. So I can put Roy like next to Percival. Oh, he has a talk. Okay, cool. General Percival. General Roy. I wish to join your cause. Will you accept me? Absolutely. We're honored to have someone of your ability. But why the sudden change of heart? Just I answer that question? No, I won't force you if you have no reason to tell. Forgive me. I'll tell you when the time comes. Okay. Uh, so there's a shop over here. I didn't bring anything to sell. And I don't know what it's actually going to give me. Uh, but we could find out. Uh, I don't think I need any of these things, to be honest. I can't remember if I need any more men's staff. It's been so long <laughs> since I actually I just haven't checked the convoy in a while. Um, I don't think I need anything, but just to be safe, I'll buy a couple men's staves. But obviously, I want to save money for the secret shop. So I should probably start saving now. Like right now. Alright, so if Elena can't reach, I can just dance for her. So it shouldn't be a problem. Um, long delay in the enemy phase. <laughs> I think the AI was trying to catch up with what the hell was going on there. Yeah, we're gonna need to dance for Elena, I think, and she should be able to make it. Yeah, easy. And. And talk. Wait. What? Who are you? Why are you attacking the villagers? Excuse me? Who do you think you are? I asked you a question. Tell me why you're attacking the villagers. Why? I guess it's your fault, really. Our fault? Yep. You idiots make war, and poor folk like me resort to raiding to survive. Try to help people like you. Do you know how many times I've heard that? This is reality, kid. You all say you're trying to help, but it's all hot air and empty promises. If you're gonna say something like that, then prove it. You don't even know what's going on. Get out of my way. No. Listen, I ain't playing games with you. If you don't get out of here, I'll do something we'll both regret. I won't move. Kill me if you will. What? If I let you pass, I too have said nothing but hot air. I tell the truth. We fight to help the people. <laughs> you. I've never met anyone so naive as you. Do you laugh at me? Bill, you've moved this old raider's heart. Does that mean? Yep, you win. I'll stop looting. But, let me fight with you. Show me firsthand that you're true to your words. Thank you. For being with us for a while, I'm positive you'll understand. Well, you certainly seem confident, at least. I'm Garrett, and you're... Delina. Delina. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance, my lady. Wouldn't it, wouldn't it be fun if it was so easy to change people's minds like that in real life? Yeah, I already went over Garrett in the last episode, but he's really solid. If you're not using as many Berserkers already as I am, then there you go. Man. 
This this reset not getting uh Gonzalez that level is really annoying. <laughs> Uh, we have a thief with a silver sword here. I'm just gonna like I'm just gonna nuke him with, with Walt, to be honest. Oh wow, he doesn't double. Walt bad. <laughs> Walt sucks! Okay, actually we need Thea to get this last bit of experience. So these guys are the next wave. Sword Reaver, Lance Reaver, oh my god. We got some wyverns up here, which no okay, that's a horse layer. We gotta be careful of that. No doubt I'm gonna guess that those guys are probably gonna have uh, reinforcements, like reinforcing wyverns from this mountain. But the other thing I kind of wanted to do, I mentioned, was ferry Roy over the hill, but honestly, Roy has so much movement and there's just so many archers here that I just don't even think I'm gonna bother. I think, um, I don't think this is gonna be enough experience just from this chip. Oh, wow. Well... God damn it. <laughs> Both Gonzalez and Thea sit in it like just close to a level. That's that's annoying. Oh well. Alright, let's get our hands on the village and see what's up. I'm gonna send the lady. This is a Hunan staff. Oh shit! <laughs> Okay, this is a big one because obviously there's so many personal weapons and rare Equipment in this in this hack the the Hermann is really valuable How many uses does it have though? Is it still three? It is still three That's that's big We have three uses of Hermann Using whatever we want so we have just we have so many good weapons. We got the Brave Lance. We have the Cortain. We've got all the legendary weapons which we can unlearn. Um we've got so much stuff. We've got the Riptide, the Brave Axe, just so many good candidates for the Hammer. Now luckily none of these weapons are very low yet. Um it does mean that I can be a little more What's the word I'm looking for? A little more relaxed in my uses of these things, I guess. Because knowing me, I'll uh, I'll forget about the fact they have a moon, and I'll be an end game with three uses of a moon. <laughs> uh, it's just like, well, I sh I could have used it while I had the chance, and I didn't. So I got to be pretty careful of this horse slayer friend over here. Do the crit. <laughs> oh. Well, I, I, that's just funny. I thought that was her crit animation for a second there. That just shows how cool a regular attack is. I love this unit. She's so good. I know I overextended her and I got her killed, but that's my fault. I know she's frail. She's still awesome, though. Okay, this was the sword we got at first, right? Yeah, okay. Out of range of the scary stuff. Uh, does Garrett have a talk with Roy? No, at least not with Garrett initiating. Because, yeah, I'm pretty sure it actually does, like, matter who initiates. No, I'm gonna... I think, oh, no, I can't rescue Drunk Gonzalez. He's too big. Of course. He is too big of a man. I'm just gonna pop this. I don't really... I didn't bring in enough healing this chapter. Uh, which was a little bit of a mistake. A little bit of a mistake. Um, you're not support A yet. No, you need to build that support. But what's likely going to happen now is my uh, mounted units of players are going to charge ahead. Most of the foot units probably aren't going to do much for the rest of the chapter. Wow, look at that hit rate. <laughs> when you counter Reaver weapons, it's really satisfying. But yeah, I hope you guys are all doing good. Um, don't really talk about like general updates in any of these Let's Play videos, but I guess it's something I can do towards the end of chapters once there's not a lot going on. Um, but yeah, hope you're all doing well. I haven't been playing as much of this game as I have as I was before in terms of just bulk recording. So I'm going to be a little more... You're going to be a little more caught up to where I'm actually playing. So if you leave any comments, it may actually be, you know, closer to where I'm at in game. 
Um, but yeah, I'm just been doing some other stuff. But don't worry, and, you know, I'm not going anywhere this series, of course. I am determined to finish my projects now. Not saying that it won't ever happen again. Oh, nice vault. Just saying, there's no need to worry. <laughs> Okay, Bia should be able to get this, but I need to make sure I can take care of everything else, but that is okay. Gonzalez is also still out of the way. Um, I think if I put him where OG is, he could actually reach that. I'm gonna try. I could have just done the math, but... That's for nerds. Okay, yeah, I can. So, I, oh, yeah, all I need was that, and that's the level up. And 2 HP. Not even a point of speed in sight. Ah, this is very sad. <laughs> Alright, and we should... This is a little scary, but hopefully she can do this. Okay, perfect. So we're gonna have two promotions on the next turn. Because, yeah, I think it's about time that Thea gets hers. Nice. Strength and defense on my flyer. And she's nearly capped her speed as well. I could, I could keep leveling her. It might... I'm, I'm always saying that I want to promote her and then I'm second guessing, but... She is still capable of killing things. That's the thing. I don't know. I'm way too indecisive about my promotions in this game. But I know the end game is going to be really tough. And I don't want to gimp out any units that could be really, uh, really good in the end game, you know? That's what's a little worrying, but... Hey, -oh. we'll, we'll see what happens. Oh, hi. Wait, I forgot about this. <laughs> uh, yeah, maybe I should protect these guys. There's also the Horse Slayer here. But that Horse Slayer is one range, so I can actually stick Roy right here, and he won't be in Horse Slayer range. And I could also get a crit. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> that guy's an Axe Reaver too, that, that kind of stinks. But I think I can put Percival here, right? Yeah. This guy's a Silverland, this guy's a Lightning. Yeah, you can't do shit to me. Cannot do shit to me. Oh, you don't have a range weapon. That can change. Four use javelin, better than nothing. That would be just a second here. Yeah? Just had to make a quick cut. Um, but yeah, I, I have no idea what I was saying before. Uh, so if I was having a uh, topic of conversation during this turn, I've completely forgotten about it because I just took like a, a five minute cut <laughs> to go do something. <laughs> so, sorry about that. But uh, yeah, we're through We're through the, the main bulk of this chapter by now. So I can just talk about random shit for most of it, but I don't want to get distracted because then I'll make a mistake. So I need to not get too distracted. Yeah, Percival's a champ. He's just gonna eat this eat this up and he's gonna crit. Holy shit. Look at this guy go But yeah, I've been thinking a lot about What comes next after this series or even during this series? You no, know, I could upload Different things at the same time if I really wanted to um, So yeah, I've been kind of considering what other projects I want to do whether that be LPs or other video projects or just whatever to do with this channel. Um, I've been just kind of trying to decide what I want to do in future, just getting ideas together. So if you guys do have any, one, two, three, four, wow. Five movement Andes, man. God damn it. <laughs> but if you guys do have any any suggestions of games you want, to want me to play or like anything you want to see on the channel, just general suggestions, you know, I'll, I can I can reply and say if I've played the game before or not, if I'm aware, if it's something I'd be interested in doing. Just anything, really. Feel free to drop any suggestions. If you have any, of course. 
and I'm you know that does I'm not promising that I'm gonna do any of them. <laughs> it just means I I'll, I'll, I'll have more things to consider, you know. Which is always it's always good. Oh, I traded away your heal staff, didn't I? Whoops. Yeah, I think I must have accidentally sent a heal staff to the convoy when I picked up a, uh, the divine tome by accident. That's kind of annoying. Man, this Valkyrie's dodge tanking me right now. Let's. Oh, I mean, maybe if I can get a crit. No, he's just just gonna dodge me. Oh, that's a crit, right? Yeah, okay, nice. Yeah, Valkyries are really fast and then <laughs> it's in the forest as well. Oh no, on oh, the mountain. Okay, that's why. Yeah, god damn. Explains a lot. Okay, uh, I want Sophia to kill a Wyvern. Hey, maybe Fia can kill a Wyvern. Maybe I can get her one more level. <laughs> Just one more level. Holy crap, she misses that. That is. That is yikes, dude. That is very yikes. Can I. I feel like Shanna's a good unit for setting up kills. No, wow, Shanna's not even a good unit for setting up kills. She just straight up sucks. God damn. Well, I mean, if Sophia doesn't crit this guy. Which I don't think she did. Honestly, the Basilisk Tome as well. I didn't even mention that. That's a good candidate for the Amun staff because this tome is kind of ridiculous. Like it's it's more accurate than Flux or Nosferatu by 15, which is pretty significant. Has 20 crit, weighs nothing, gives you speed plus three, and is effective against flyers. Like this shit's ridiculous. <laughs> It's crazy good. Uh, yeah, I like this. But never mind, we're not getting two promotions this turn. Um, Thea is gonna be end game ready. I am gonna promote Gonzalez though. I didn't completely, completely lie. I'm also worried that a kitten is gonna start to fall off because her growths kind of suck. I'm hoping that a good support with like Gonzalez and having the guard act is gonna help her out. I mean, she might be a good candidate for some stat boosters. Like a speed wings would probably help her out quite a lot just to get her to that that break point. That makes sense. Um, who needs experience? Probably Milady, actually. So as soon as she gets a little more speed and a little more bulk, then she's just gonna be unstoppable. Because don't get me wrong, her bases in this in this hack are really, really good. But if she gets a few more levels with her really good growth, she's just gonna be unstoppable. Right now she's really solid, but like she isn't you know, I don't think of Milady like I think of Pa right now. I think Ten Har is just absolute it's yeah. Kind of ridiculous. Just a little bit. Anyway, uh, yeah, you guys have seen this promotion already, but I'm gonna show it again. Unless I'm completely forgetting, but I'm pretty sure in the previous episode, before I died, I did promote Gonzalez, right? I short-term memory is 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 hard. But uh, yeah, that's that's a beefy boy. That's a very very beefy boy. Not in terms of raw defense, <laughs> but yeah, I mean, even considering that Gonzalez has so much HP, he is a good candidate for a Draco shield, because um, obviously his defense sucks, but he has really good HP, so it kind of doesn't matter in most cases. I'm just going to break this physics staff, dude. I think this is... I'm just going to clog up my inventory space later, too. <laughs> Goodbye, Physic. You will not be forgotten. Okay. Um. I don't know who Percival supports with, now that I think about it. I should check that. 
Luckily, there's a handy dandy link in the description which takes you to uh, triangleattack.com or whatever it's called, which has all those kinds of resources for Project Ember. Isn't that handy? Oh, hi. Yeah, I'm just gonna wrap this up now. I hope oh, okay. Well, those paladins not moving is kind of annoying. I'd hope they would uh, come towards me. <laughs> These green units are still desperate to take something on. Silver Lance. Silver. Oh God. Um. Yeah, that's kind of kind of irritating. Might just hold hold up these forts for a wee bit. I can go in this forest. I mean, I can't retaliate on the uh, the archers anyway, so I might just use a steel sword. Craziness. So the video that just recent, most recently uploaded is the video where Roy promotes. Um, and man, like, I don't think I appreciate how insane Roy got even after his promotion bonuses. Like he is just, he's level 10, nearly level 11 already, which is just kind of insane. This man is just showing no signs of stopping. Oh, slowing down. I mean, he is slowing down now because he reached the speed gap. <laughs> that hurts. I don't want to do that. I'm just going to stick you in here. I hope we have more wind edges in the convoy. Is that really good? Uh, armor Slayer. Good job I'm not using any armor knights. Yeah, I, I kind of, after some, doing some inspection and some reflection on the chapters I've been playing, the game really, really hard pushes you to use one of the armor knights early on. And I think I definitely made things harder for myself by not using one of the armor knights early on. Because they are very obviously the only units that you have at that point in the game that can take any hits. And the enemies very quickly get equipment that does a shit ton of damage, like very high might equipment. And most of your units early on are very frail. Except for units like, um, Bath and Debius and all the armor knights you get early on. Yeah, I can use a sword reader. Um, and because you can promote them so early, so they're going to become a general that's just a mega, mega bulky. Um, but I didn't, oh shit, wait. Oh, thank god, that was a lucky space. But I just didn't use one, and I can see, yeah, like, the strat, some very valuable strats early on would be to just, um, tank stuff with your armor knights, and then everyone runs in from the back line. Seems like the main strat. Grin's still injured at all. Oh, hi. Um, okay. <laughs> nah, okay, I could have actually been in trouble if everything hit me here. But, we get lucky. Because that's how this works. And of course, Fear gets hit by the first attack. I mean... God damn it, Fear. Why do you do this to me? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Strength, skill, speed. Okay. Still no defense. She is still frail as fuck. That is a brave bow. That is a brave bow. Are you shitting me? You can't be serious right now. Three... Around 30% in a row? That's like... Probably like 10%. Fuck me. In the asshole, man. God. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Alright, everyone. I'm back.
back all the way at the end. We got the victory music now. Um, this time, <laughs> Gonzalez actually leveled defense on both of his final levels. I couldn't believe it. Uh, he also leveled speed once as well, which is really nice. So I got much better levels than Gonzalez. I just promoted him. Uh, Theodore unfortunately did not get as good levels. So I want to kind of give her a, like at least one more here, which I actually can do. Like, oh, I guess I should put animation back on. Probably should do that. Well, that's a level up, I guess. <laughs> Uh, don't think there was really anything else to know. I did end up playing a little bit slower in terms of moving forward. So the green units actually caught up and they were really annoying and stole some kills. Which kind of sucks. Oh, maybe, oh, maybe Sophia. Sophia kill, boy. Yeah, this took way longer than it should have done. I can't believe they fucking, I can't believe Sophia died like that. That was so stupid. <laughs> Okay, don't crit Lelina. Nice. Good job. Look at that. Look at that. So, no guiding ring in this chapter, but I, like, I think I was saying this before, that there's a lot of treasure in chapter 16. Ooh, nice. So, maybe there'll be a guiding ring in there. Who knows? Anyway. Uh, yeah, this guy's a pushover. He's not even the real boss, he's just a stand-in for the boss we already killed, and... That sucks. Crit Roy. No. Well... That fucking sucks. That, that does indeed suck. I'm just gonna physic Roy just to be safe, because... I'm not taking any risks to slay into the chapter, believe it or not. Okay, you guys gonna... No, alright. Whatever. Oh yeah, get up out. <laughs> bye bye. So yeah, sadly I didn't get the bullying, so I just didn't bring my thieves. But it's fine, it was only one small bully and I could do without it. Yeah, L Roy leveled defense as well, by the way, finally. So, I mean, he's just becoming more and more unstoppable. Um, now all that remains is, I think, promote the, uh, which I am gonna do. So, here we go. It's about them time. There she is. Hopefully gonna be better than her sister. Well, I already know she's gonna be better than her sister. Yeah. They're not the biggest gains, but it's certainly gonna make the difference. Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. And she'll continue to grow. She has pretty good uh, strength and defense growth. If you look at Shanna, I mean, obviously her skill and speed is halved, but yeah. 10 defense, not amazing. And she has also gained a couple levels. So, I think Tia's overall gonna be better in most situations. Still no support, guys. Come on. What the hell? Alright, well, there we go. That was chapter 15. Lord Roy, here she is. You found her? I believe you are Lord Roy, and a thank you, young lady. <laughs> Easy, Melanus. Why did you follow us? I just wanted to see the outside world. You put yourself in danger for such a trivial reason? Do you know how much trouble you've caused? But, but I'm I'm never ever allowed outside. The elder says I have to remain hidden. I'm always alone, locked up in my room. Well, Roy, what should we do? You could have been killed. Do you understand how much worry and trouble you've caused? Yes, I'm sorry. Truly? Yes. All things considered, I think we have no choice but to take you with us. Really? Are you sure? The enemy might already know about her now. If that's true, she'll be safer with us than returning unguarded to Arcadia. Hooray! This isn't a cause for celebration! <laughs> you mustn't run off alone anymore. Do you promise? Yes, I pinky swear. General Percival, we will station ourselves at this castle. We should prepare for further attacks from the revolutionaries. 
Yes, please do. Found this in the castle. Please take it. Everyone, Percival, please save Aturia. I will. Count on it. Yes, sir. Huh. Was that always the case? I guess it would make sense. I don't remember getting that, though. You cool, Lord Eddie Wood? Ah. Yes. Please come in, Lowen. Yeah, this is new. Lord Eddie Wood, how have you been feeling? I have some off days, but overall, I think I've been feeling better. I see. I'm confident that it will only get better from here. That aside, what have you requested my presence for, my lord? But, Roy, I've received word of his army's latest movements. I believe he is on his way to Aklia to contend against Burns' forces, as well as the corrupt Etrurian nobles. I'd like for you to go to his aid. Aklia, the Etrurian capital? It sounds like there will be a first battle. Exactly. So it's a difficult situation. Do not need to, we do need to maintain our defenses over here in Lysia, but still. I want to help my son as much as I can. I'm sure that a veteran knight experiences yourself will be more than enough. Understood. Your trust in me will not be misplaced, my lord. When you leave, I shall make my way over there immediately. Thank you, Lowen. Now, go and show them the power of the Knights of Furay. Aklia. I believe that's somewhat far to the northeast. I better hurry so I can make it on time. Ooh, interesting changes and additions. Yeah, I'm a, I like this one. I know not everyone's a big fan of, of, of uh, changes and additions like that, but I, I do like it. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Fire Emblem 6, Project Ember. I hope you did enjoy. Next time we'll be doing the chapter 16, which has one of the most annoying guide and chapter requ uh, requirements. Um, but I hope it should be a fun one, fun castle map. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then. Take it easy. Bye-bye.